So, uh, I impulse bought a backhoe. Always wanted one, sort of. Always had the natural inclination to dig holes. And uh, the main reason I bought this is because part of my, my five year plan, if you will, involves some construction that I'll need to dig some trenches for. Or I could buy this colossal thing for nine grand and fix it up. Kidding, I didn't pay that. Uh, but anyway, this is exponentially cheaper than buying a little three point backhoe. And it's a real backhoe, it's much bigger, it comes with a front loader. That's right, it is a 1961 something ish tractor with a power reverser transmission just like the 2017 Kubota has. So what do we know about this? Not all that much. Uh, the guy I bought it from, he it's off some property that he bought and this and another backhoe was just kind of sitting there and um, I know that it was last screwed with about 2012 because the battery in here has a 2012 date on the top of it so hopefully they had it running then so it hasn't been sitting for 30 years. It's probably enough rambling. Let's see if this engine will actually spin or show some signs of life. I'm at least 50% certain this thing is in neutral. Ah, lack of ground. I tried to find something to ground to on this that's not painted and or rusty didn't go very well. Very nice. What hell? Is this too rusty also? No sparking. Why no electrical? <laughs> oh, all right. Engage, thing. No one really knows what's up with this thing, so ultimately what we'll do, we'll take it in the shop, we'll remove all this old crappy wiring, and uh, at the very least reach through here with a pry bar, see if we can get that engine to turn and figure out why the starter's not engaging on that flywheel. But I honestly don't think there's a single speck of rust on any one of these cylinders anywhere on the tractor. There's plenty of this goop everywhere, there's what looks like a little paint on here somehow. Pretty much everything but rust, which I hope is the case.